Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com, Rainex, Hum by Verizon, State Farm, and WeatherTech. In the USA, many know racing as NASCAR or the Indianapolis 500. For the rest of the world, it's mainly one letter, one number, F1. No fenders, no windshield, one seat. To drive an open-wheeled F1 car competitively is the crown jewel of racing, the winners seen as royalty. A trip to Summit Point Motorsports Park in West Virginia is where we found one driver practicing determined to stand in the number one spot. In 2016, the pilot of this car won the first ever F4 championship held in the U.S. Today, we're hanging out with 18-year-old Cameron Doss. The road to F1 is long, expensive, and contains plenty of obstacles along the way with no guarantee of ever securing a seat. A typical route starts with karting, moving to F4, followed by F3, then 2, and finally F1, with each progression adding race intensity. And fresh off a flight from the UK, Cameron, where are you racing now? I'm racing in Euroformula Open F3 in Europe. It's been an exciting season, and I'm glad to be a part of it. Many young racers get their start in karts around age eight. Cameron didn't start until 15. Two years later, he finished top five in British F3. Still in high school, planning to attend a university after graduation, Cameron says professional race drivers need to differ from others. On the side, he's also developing a web series where he predicts future classic cars. How would you describe what it's like to take this thing around turns? Well, this car is obviously a lot lighter than a street car, and we're running on slick tires, so everything happens so much faster. When the car breaks loose, it breaks loose all at once and very quickly. The reaction times have to be so much higher. Uh, your physical ability has to be a lot higher. Powered by Honda, 2018 is the first F3 America's series. These Civic Type R engines are shelling out 270 horsepower, the car weighing around 1,400 pounds. No power steering, no ABS, no traction control. The mood was tense. An outsider hopping into a full-fledged race team's baby. My extremities shaking, brain on overdrive. All right, I've got to use the clutch here to get me out of first gear. From then on, I'm only using the paddle shifters. And let's go, baby! I did not stall it in front of everyone. We're off to a good start. This car costs over $120,000, and it's one of only a few of F3 America's practice cars. If I wreck this thing today, I'm going into hiding, and I will never be seen again. And then it's just warp speed instantly. Oh, I'm going to get used to this quickly. I mean, I, I just cannot believe that this is real life. I feel like I'm in a driving simulator. You know, I noticed very quickly on turn one, I'm using my wrists to steer here. I'm not using my whole arms because there is not enough room for that to happen anyway. Oh, absolutely bonkers. Unbelievable. By far the craziest thing I've ever driven. Probably the craziest thing I ever will drive. It's raw, it's wild, and it's confusing because it does everything you want it to do. You are so connected to the ground, no track control. You feel the air coming across the hills and moving you left and right. It's nuts. But I'm just starting, so please don't ever wake me up. 